does perpetual motion really not exist? But a man has crafted a contraption resembling a perpetual motion machine out of simple materials. Not only does it spin rapidly, but it also lights up a light bulb. It's truly miraculous. Now, let's share the entire fabrication process. Let's figure out where things went wrong. First, mark the bearings sizes on a wooden board, then cut according to the marks to obtain this wooden structure. Next, fix the bearings onto the wooden board, ensuring they can rotate freely. Insert a wooden plug into the middle of the bearings, then nail an iron nail on top of it. Just apply force on the iron nail, and the bearings will spin rapidly then secure the contraption onto a wooden baseboard. Next, prepare two syringes, remove the plunger, and cut off the top part, then fix two magnets. On the front end, use glue to fix a thin plastic tube on the rear end of the plunger. Encase the syringe shells with circular magnets and firmly glue them in place. Now you can see there's a certain rebound force. When the plunger is pushed into the syringe, connect the syringes to the bearings with two prepared iron wires. Secure the syringes firmly with glue on both ends. Finally, mount a 12-volt small generator. On the baseboard, connect the drive shaft to the wooden plug between the bearings. So, when the bearings spin, they power the generator. With that, the entire contraption is complete. Just gently apply an initial force and the bearings spin rapidly with no need for any other power source connect the light bulb to the generator and it lights up what's the principle behind this how did they manage to do it does anyone know out of a hundred how many points would you give